Greg, your instant reaction to this idea that Rod Rosenstein has resigned, according to sources, to Bloomberg? Uh, instant reaction, and you asked this question before. Uh, this brings a little instability to Mueller's probe. Rosenstein, who appointed Mueller, Rosenstein, who has backed up Mueller at every step of the way, including approving a controversial um, uh, search warrant. Uh, 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 you know, they, Rosenstein was fully invested in supporting this investigation. So anyone who comes in, it's not guaranteed that they'll be as supportive or be able to keep the political pressure at a distance. Is that why it's happening? It appears to be that way. Uh, the fact that these memos were leaked last week that made Rosenstein look very bad, the fact that it came out just within a week or two of uh, Mueller's biggest victory, getting Manafort to agree to plead guilty and cooperate, uh, it does seem like a coincidence. So, Greg, who takes over now? We went through you Noel know, Feldman's article. He does the whole rabbit hole, come up with Noel Francisco. He doesn't have a criminal prosecution record, and he doesn't have, uh, you know, he is not completely conflict-free. So what happens now? Do well, we get what happens another... now, uh, this will become a, a political issue in the midterm elections. And if the Democrats win in the House, um, uh, or just gain power, and particularly in the Senate as well, this will change the dynamics yeah. around the investigation. So I don't expect to be there to be any overt attempt to shut down or constrain Mueller in the next six to eight weeks before the midterm election. In terms of, I, I, let me ask the question that I asked before as well, how will Robert Mueller be looking at this process and thinking about how he carries on doing his job? A, um, like the, you know, Marine captain he was uh, decades ago, he will just, you know, keep on. One of his strengths in the last year and a half has been not to flinch or get distracted by all the noise, all the criticism, everything that's been coming out on Twitter and elsewhere about him. So I expect that will continue.